Adventure Stories made for you by Digan George Siren Monster's Quest Exhausted Siren Monster lay down to bed to rest his body and mind. It was almost a long time since he had been home. Unknown to Siren Monster, his bed has been occupied by invisible dwarves. These dwarves, according to folklore, are members of mythical race of short and stocky human-like creatures who possess magical power. Laid in two by the Siren Monster, the dwarves were disturbed and decided to punish him by bringing him down the World of Wonders. The World of Wonders is a mystic world consisting of many rooms with different quests to overcome on each room. Sorry Monster, in order to come back on his world, shall at least completely and perfectly answer the set of questions given in one of the rooms. Nervous as he is, Siren Monster faces the challenge with enthusiasm. Thinking that the smallest door offers an easiest quest, he chose and entered the same. There, he saw the mystic various shapes on different colors. Siren Monster had chosen the Room of Shapes. The shapes comprise of the circle, triangle, square, star, and rectangle. In starting the quest, the shapes simultaneously utter the rhyme. All the shapes are here today. They love to jump and they love to play. They're having such fun and they're sure to stay. But who I am? The circle, the planets revolved on. Asked the circle. Siren Monster, thinking of his recent space adventure, knew that it was the sun. Indeed, it is the sun, a circle in shape of which the eight planets revolved on. Came again the rhyming song of the shapes and of the question. But what I am, the triangle that protects you from the rain and the sun? Asked the triangle. Siren Monster thought of an umbrella and of the roof. By answering both, the good of wonders accepts it, as they are both of triangle shape. The shapes then continued, and the square asked, But what I am, the square that you love to be, the happy you smile and frown away. Siren Monster had a hard time answering it, but associates the same to reading, and he answered for a book. It is a book, a thing in square shape that often brings different emotions to its readers. Down the two questions to go, the shapes continued, and the star asked, But what I am? A star that is not a fairy, yet you utter a wish. Siren Monster immediately answers for a falling star. Yes, it is a falling star. Again, the shapes sing their song. All the shapes are here today. They love to jump and they love to play. They're having such fun and they're sure to stay. But what I am? A rectangle, you rest, and the last thing you were on at, asked the rectangle. Siren Monster, without a doubt, speaks off his bed. Suddenly, Siren Monster finds himself waking up on his bed, with his friends surrounding him, awaiting for their next adventure. <laughs>